Imagine a five-year-old girl thrown out of a sixth-floor window, who could do such a thing? On the fateful night of March 29, 2008, this grim reality was faced by Isabella Nardoni. She was spending the weekend at her father's apartment in the north zone of Sao Paulo. Accompanying her was her father, Alexander Nardoni, her stepmother, Anna Carolina Jatoba, and her two half-brothers, merely one and three years old at the time. The night unfolded with a horrifying twist. Little Isabella was thrown out of the window of the sixth floor. Initially, her father and stepmother painted a picture of a home invasion gone wrong. They claimed that a thief had broken into the apartment, sliced through the protective screen of one of the rooms, and hurled Isabella out the window. But as the investigation unfolded, a more chilling story emerged. What could possibly drive a parent to harm their own child? This question echoed in the minds of investigators as they delved into the tragic demise of Isabella Nardoni. The initial claim was of a break-in, a thief who supposedly cut a protective screen and threw Isabella out the window. However, the grim reality soon unfolded. The investigation revealed a chilling conclusion. Isabella was asphyxiated by her stepmother, Anna Carolina Jatoba, and then thrown from the sixth floor by her father, Alexander Nardoni. In March of 2010, Alexander and Anna Carolina faced a popular jury, their trial spanning five arduous days. Throughout the trial, the couple steadfastly denied their involvement in the crime. Yet, the evidence was irrefutable. The jury found them guilty of triple qualified homicide and procedural fraud. Despite their denial, Alexander and Anna Carolina were sentenced to lengthy prison terms. Years later, where are the people involved in this shocking case now? Alexander Nardoni, Isabella's father, is now 44 years old and is serving a sentence of 31 years in a semi-open regime at the penitentiary Dr. Jose Augusto Cesar Salgado, P2, in Tremembe, interior of Sao Paulo. Anna Carolina Jatoba, Isabella's stepmother, is 39 years old. Since June of this year she has been serving her 26-year sentence in an open regime. The life of Isabella's mother, Anna Carolina Oliveira, has taken a turn. She is now 39 years old, married and mother of two children, Miguel, seven years old, and Maria Fernanda, three years old. In the Netflix documentary, she spoke about the realization of her dream of being a mother again, and the death of Isabella. This June she criticized the progression of punishment for Anna Carolina Jatoba to an open regime. The story of Isabella Nardoni continues to haunt us, a stark reminder of the darkness that can lurk in the most unexpected places.